Andy Murray was the least worked of the semi-finalist, needing less than nine hours on court as he breezed through a series of straight sets victories. Frenchman Gilles Simon, the number 14 seed, was the highest ranked player he faced. The easy ride came to an end as he confronted Roger Federer for the first time in a Grand Slam semi-final. Murray was on top from the start. But Federer hasn't amassed 17 Grand Slams without being capable of fighting back. It went to a final set decider. And Murray grabbed the initiative. After a four-hour cliffhanger, it was Federer who fell. And the Scot pulled his way into the final.